everyone. Today, I'm going to introduce you guys to Tani Lam. I recently met her. She has an interesting journey. I, okay, that's kind of going into too much, maybe. Uh, the tip is their journey. But anyway, Tani, kind of introduce yourself, kind of go through your history. What do you do now? To What do you plan to do in the future or whatever your journey is? Hello, my name is Tani Lam. I am a children's book author. I have actually written two books. Um, I love to travel and that is what inspired me to write my children's books. So my first book is about the US Virgin Islands. Mm -hmm. And my second book is about my favorite, one of my favorite regions in the world, the Mediterranean. Gotcha. Um, and sorry. So I love to travel. <laughs> I've, been to over, <laughs> I've been to over 45 countries, over 35 states. And I'm just trying to um, put that love of traveling in the in, into the next generation. So I'm trying to make the children enjoy it a little bit. Enjoy then share, share your journeys and share the culture, I assume. But you also have another profession. So I don't know if you want to share it or not. Oh, yeah. I, I have a hair salon, too. So I, I make women beautiful. So that's also my uh, another passion of mine. <laughs> awesome. All right. So uh, in the future, obviously. OK, let's go ahead and get into that. So, you know, obviously your passion now is traveling and mm -hmm. kind of educating kids or sharing your passion with the kids. Uh, is that going to be where you're going to focus or go full time eventually? Or are you going to do all three kind of are, you know, what's your, what's your journey going forward, I guess. I mean, of course, in a dream world, <laughs> you know, I could just retire as like a famous author and travel the world. Um, I think that would be like awesome. Um, but I, I, I do enjoy travel and I actually do enjoy writing. I enjoy the art of storytelling, um, taking my, my own adventures and turning it into another story. It's actually very, it's, it's enjoyable for me. So um, yes, so if I had my way, I would be a full-time writer. That would be perfect and still travel. Let's not forget the travel That's and travel. Right. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, see her journeys. Um, I, I, I will share her information. I believe you have a YouTube channel and, you know, obviously website and all that. She has a website so you can go see her, uh, obviously work, you know, the, uh, you know, especially for your kids. If you want to, um, you know, share that, uh, her books with her, uh, go to the website. I'll share the website and whatever information of, uh, of, of Tani. So if you want more information, you probably can connect, connect to her directly. I will be, uh, sharing that info, obviously. So please connect to her and see um, maybe, you know, there's something synergies between you guys. All right, Tani. So I guess I can get uh, pretty much anybody who heard it probably can imagine what inspires you to get up and do what you do every day, but kind of share what inspires you to get up and do what you do every day. Um, I actually, one of my favorite things when I travel, I love meeting the locals. I love exploring the culture. And I, I, I don't want to be a tourist. I actually want to submerge myself um, into the culture. And one thing that I am grateful for is most of, most of the places that I've actually visited, I've met people and I have friends that I call. And when I go back, we hang out. So it's not just um, like a, a little short three-day vacation. I actually want to be in the culture if that makes sense. Sure. Um, and, and, and you can't, it's something money can't buy. I mean, you need money to take the trip, <laughs> but it's just the experience and, and, and making new friends and eating food that you've never had before and seeing things that you've only read about in the pages of a book. For me, that's priceless. And, and that's why I wake up every morning and, and go to work so I can buy plane tickets. <laughs> Awesome. So I can travel. <laughs> and then write books awesome yeah i mean people heard the little bit intro i obviously couldn't imagine that would be your passion all right perfect since your travels and all the journeys and doing your own uh, business and writing books obviously you probably have some tips and tricks to share what would be the one tip 
you would share personal professional that can help others that has helped you Ooh, one tip um well um and don't give up um it's it it can be hard but just don't give up you will hit roadblocks you will have obstacles but just keep going i remember with my first book um everything that went wrong could <laughs> um the 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 cover was wrong the print was wrong the binding was wrong but i just kept redoing it until i got it right i remember um it took a few people um but i finally got it to the cover that i wanted and i got it uploaded on amazon i got it uploaded on on barnes and noble but it was um it it, it, it was hard <laughs> and i think um that's the problem. A lot of people, after a few things going wrong, they would give up, but you can't give up. You just have to keep, <laughs> you have to keep going. Awesome. That's a great tip. Persistence, uh, you know, that, 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 that always wins over everything. And yeah, I mean, whether, whatever venture you're on, obviously without persistence, nothing works. And there's a saying, or, you know, the universe tests you to see how much you want it. So if you want a success, then you got to overcome those. Yeah, great tip, Tani. All right, thanks for taking the time. And I, like I said, I'll be sharing Tani's, uh, you know, website and whatever information I have. So look her up, visit her, and uh, see you want to buy those books and share it with your kids. And thanks again, Tani. Thank you.